Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Can you apply for food stamps after being denied? If you've been denied food stamps, also known as SNAP benefits, you might be wondering if you can apply again. The answer is yes, you can definitely apply again, but there are some important details to know. First, let's talk about why you might have been denied in the first place. Common reasons include not providing the required verifications, having too much income, or not meeting other eligibility criteria like student requirements or work requirements. If your application was denied because you didn't provide the necessary verifications, there's a window of opportunity to get your case reopened without having to reapply. In many states, if you provide the missing verifications within 30 days of the denial, your case can be reinstated. For example, in Massachusetts, if you get the proofs to the Department of Transitional Assistance, DTA, within this 30-day period, your case should get reopened and you won't need to reapply. Here's how it typically works. If your application is denied for lack of proofs, you'll receive a notice listing the specific proofs that are still missing and giving you another 30 days to provide them. If you send in the missing documents within this time frame, your case will be reopened and your benefits may be prorated. However, if your application was denied for other reasons, such as being over income or not meeting student requirements, you'll need to reapply for benefits. The case manager will have to complete a new request for assistance workflow, and you'll have to go through the application process again. It's also important to note that you can appeal the denial if you believe it was incorrect. This process allows you to challenge the decision and potentially get your application accepted. In summary, if you were denied food stamps, you can apply again at any time. If the denial was due to missing verifications, you might have a chance to get your case reopened within a specific time frame. Otherwise, you'll need to submit a new application. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Want the inside scoop on your neighborhood? Imagine knowing exactly what your neighbors paid or who actually owns that stunning house down the block. At countyoffice.org, you can create a free account and snoop through over 150 million property records, owner names, mortgage details, sale prices, all those things other sites make you pay for. Don't miss out on the fun. Just Google countyoffice.org property records or head to countyoffice.org directly and create your free account today. Go on, get your snoop on.